Hello guys and welcome to another video on Marvel Contest of Champions. In this video we'll be going over the side quest Hades Rifts. Now the first thing to note here is to how to gain entry into these rifts. For that we need to go to our solo events and scroll down to an event known as Energy Harvest. Now in this event we'll get something called Chaotic Dimensional Energy. These are basically key tokens required to enter into the rifts. Now that we have our tokens, let's get into the rifts. So we'll go for the threat level 5 which will have the best rewards possible for us. So if you guys are unaware about the rifts, how these work is you will be teleported to a random portal and from there you can collect whatever rewards are available in that path. So as you can see there are some paths tagged as common, some uncommon and some are rare. This basically tells you how good the rewards on that paths are. Also we can see several chests in each path and uh, this chest will basically contain the rare or uncommon resources that we can collect so let's check this one is hades rift path c so path c will have 3006 star shards and all that stuff also i can see a six star generic awakening gem so i think that will be pretty good if we can somehow land on that path so let's chance it and see where we land up. So I think we have landed on path A. Okay so these are the rewards we can choose from. Now the first defender on this path is Spider Gwen. She has only one node on her that is foresight. Okay so intercepting will give us a bunch of attack. Now fighting against Spider Gwen only one thing is to be taken care of is she can evade and with Shang-Chi we can apply a slow debuff on her and after that she won't be able to evade so that fight will be pretty simple after that. So the second fight on this path is against Anti-Venom and I was quickly checking if he has a villain tag so I will try using Blade against him but he does not so we will be again using Shang-Chi against him. Now the last fight before the boss is Symbiote Supreme and he is also not very difficult or tricky defender. We can simply take him down with Shang-Chi again. 
and will save blade for the boss fight also uh, the boss on this route is uh, hood and he's a dimensional being so blade will have an advantage with danger sense So there's a nice option to swap one of the champions before the boss fight. I will simply bring in Stark Spidey which will enhance the potency for danger sense as I'll be using blade against hood for the final fight. And since hood as we know is a dimensional being so blade will have danger sense activated against him and with Stark Spidey the danger sense again will have increased potency. Notes on the hood are pretty simple, nothing major to be taken care of. And with that we have completed our first run on the Hades Rifts. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.